Love Island fans have voted for Hayley Hughes and Charlie Frederick to be dumped from the villa, with the two leaving the ITV2 show on Friday's episode. Alex George and Samira Mighty in a vote for who would stay on the ITV2 show, with the public choosing to save the latter. The pair faced fan favorite Strive. Hayley and Charlie only just paired up at the recoupling earlier this week but after hitting a roadblock in their romance, their co-stars deemed them one of the least compatible couples on the show. Alex and Samira, who are only coupled up as friends, were also voted incompatible but fans were clearly keen for them to stay in the villa in the search of love. Caroline Flack entered the villa on Friday night to deliver the bad news, marking her first appearance on screen since the series launch at the beginning of June. Speaking to the Islanders she said, I'm sure you are all wondering why I'm here. As you know, yesterday you all voted for who you thought were the least compatible couples. The couples who received the most votes risk being dumped from the island tonight. Please can you all stand up? One by one. Caroline then revealed the couples who are safe, listing off Josh Denzel and Georgia Steele, Jack Fincham, and Danny Dyer. Wes Nelson and Laura Anderson, Adam Collard and Rosie Williams and Dale Booker and Megan Barton Hansen. This left Alex and Samira and Haley and Charlie in danger of leaving, with Caroline then revealing that Alex and Samira were safe. Charlie and Haley then said their goodbyes before departing the Mallorca Villa as fans rushed to Twitter, slamming Haley for being the reason behind Charlie's exit. Viewers speculated that the 23-year-old model wouldn't have received many votes due to the public's desire to send Haley home. How CP is it that Charlie is a genuine sound guy and he has to take the fall because Haley's an actual riot who's probably compatible with exactly zero people? I feel sorry for the guy hashtag Love Island wrote one viewer. Love Island continues nightly at 9pm on ITV2.